is a big day, to say the least, for the presidential candidates as they get ready to tackle their first debate of this election season. President Obama and Mitt Romney have been busy preparing for several days that it all comes down to tonight. NBC's Tracy Potts is live at the University of Denver for us this morning with a look at what we can expect to hear when they take the stage. Well, uh, good morning, Tracy. Of course, uh, an important night uh, for both candidates. They've only met uh, a few times in the past. They did talk more recently on the phone. Uh, so they barely know each other. How are they being coached for this debate? Well, you know, they both obviously want to do their best. And, and it's interesting, you know, what's been going on behind closed doors with these debate preparations. From what we're told, uh, President Obama is being coached to keep his answers a little bit shorter. You know, not Obama the professor, but uh, Obama the, uh, the political candidate. And also to be more aggressive in going after Mitt Romney and, and some of the uh, charges that he's made. Now, on the other side, Romney apparently has been practicing with Rob Portman to keep his cool, uh, not to lose his cool, to uh, not appear or be irritated when he's challenged, which is certain to happen tonight. Well, of course, Tracy, there um, is a new poll out this morning. You know, how are you uh, feeling or how do you think that the voters are feeling about the candidates and tonight's debate? Well, you know, it's interesting because not everyone's really interested in these debates. Uh, about 4 in 10, just short of 4 in 10, said that they're really interested or quite interested in the debates. But the majority said that they're either only somewhat interested or not at all. Now, the other thing that's interesting in these polls is where the candidates stand going into the debates. Mitt Romney clearly has some momentum. President Obama holding steady at 49 percent and a lot of people more than ever now saying that they think the economy is turning around on the right track. That's working in his favor. Uh, but Romney now at 46 percent and also moving up in some of the key swing states as well. And uh, Tracy, we understand tonight's debate format uh, will be a little bit different than in years past. What should we expect? Well, six different segments over the 90 minutes, 15 minutes each. Each has a particular topic like health care or the role of government. Uh, obviously, the economy and jobs are going to be a big topic in this debate. What they're trying to do is get past the one-minute answer, 30-second response, canned answers, rehearsed answers. They're trying to spend more time on these topics to really sort of get in depth because what uh, the polls have been telling us and, and what people have been telling us is they want to hear specifics, details. You say you're going to create jobs. How are you going to do it? Is it going to work? Hopefully we'll hear some of that tonight. Yes, let's hope so. All right, Tracy Potts in Denver for us this morning. Thanks for your time. And of course, we'll be airing tonight's debate right here on Channel 2 at 8 o'clock. We'll stay with